Hello, and welcome to Drake's Gaming. I'm Drake, and this is episode one of my Neverwinter Adventure. In this episode, we're going to be covering character creation. So let's get started. What you want to see in a game. We've had uh, some success with some of the other games that they've put out. Dungeons & Dragons Online was pretty good, but... Yeah, the Neverwinter series, Neverwinter Nights, and whatnot in this uh, are definitely up there. These are really cool. Okay, so I'm usually particular to uh, to, to dragon kind or uh, something that's not your normal human, so I'm going to go with a tiefling. And I'm going to go with a male. Down here it talks about the what tieflings are all about and why they are the way they are. And they have the racial abilities, you have bloodlust, or blood hunt, sorry, ability score, you get two charisma, and either two constitution or two intelligence, and internal wrath. Pretty cool. Alright, so let's continue. And now we get to pick our class. So this is a control wizard. Let's start over here on the left. We have the trickster rogue, voted cleric, your control wizard, hunter ranger, great weapon fighter, well, that's pretty cool, guardian fighter, uh, your sword and shield, and coming soon, no idea what that's all about, I'm not really sure what's going on, it's going to be in this, uh, in this empty slot down here. Sounds interesting. Alright, so let's see. I'm quite fond of either the trickster rogues or hunter rangers. Basically rangers are rogues. So that's one of my things. I think let's see you've got melee stance, you've got a hindering shot, hindering strike, and nature. Hmm. Stealth, bait and switch, bloodbath, and thievery. I'm all about thievery, man. You get into some of those lock boxes. Uh, you can't get into them with the other the other classes. All right, so we're gonna stick with this guy. We get to reroll scores. Nice. Hmm. Primary abilities: dexterity. We've got an 18 there. Charisma and strength. Let's reroll this a couple times. Probably screwed that up because I had an 18 in dexterity right off the bat. Hmm. Let's see if I can get back to that. Oh, this is going to take a little bit. Oh, there we go. Alright, let's keep that. Uh, racial ability we have plus 2 charisma, plus 2 constitution, or plus 2 charisma and plus 2 intelligence. Charisma and constitution. More charisma and intelligence. All right, so intelligence helps us get into things. Charisma keeps us alive a little bit longer. Uh, I'm sorry, constitution. So let's go with intelligence, because if I do it right, they're not going to get anywhere near me. I have some presets. Pretty nice. And some pretty cool preset looks there. Or... Apparently we can customize, so let's do that. Let's zoom in a little bit here. Let's hide the armor. Head shape. We have the different uh, options here. I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time on this. Actually, let's go to head shape. I was on here. Closer? Oh, well, sure it can. Alright. It's sharp, focused, stern part. Chiseled. Mean. Full. Wide. Natural. I will go with chiseled. Hair.
How's that style? I don't get it. Short wavy, short, slick back, shaved hawk. That's nice. Shaved fade, shaved, receding, because you can't really tell because of the damn horns, anyways. Shaved fade, shaved, uh, I already saw those ponytail. Ponytail side. Tell strands. Oh, I guess he's got strands down the side of his face there. Parted mohawk short, mohawk medium tight back, uh, medium part and center, and long draped, long faux hawk, dreads tied, dreads thick, dreads. That doesn't even look like dreads. What the hell they're talking about? And bald. Um, just go with ponytail for him. Eyes, natural. Eyebrows. Okay. Facial hair, nothing. Complexion. We have cute, young, handsome, rough, weathered, middle-aged, worn, old, and elderly. I'm gonna go with um go with handsome. Let's change his color. Let's uh there, I like that color better. Alright, horns. Apparently we have a few choices here. Horns two, horns three. It's kinda crazy. Horns five. Not really fond of those. Ooh, broken horns. Tiefling horns. I thought they were all tiefling horns. What the hell's up with that? No, it just got me all confused. Alright, I like I'm a little rugged, so I'll have one busted there. Tattoos. Let's pick a lighter color so we can see what the hell we're doing here. Got a white. Hmm. These are kind of. Yeah. tattoos when it comes to my characters. Alright, um... That dragon one, or whatever the heck that was. Or was it? Mm. Mm. Oh, there you go. Great Worm. Yeah, close enough. Dragon Great Worm. Alright, so now let's, um... We are going to change that to make it look a little cooler. Something that stands out. This is kind of subtle. Alright, uh, scars. Let's look at the scars here. Nose cut. Can't really see the scars very well, anyways. And we'll go with none. Face scaling. Well, we can kind of go crazy with this thing, but we're not going to do that. Alright, body shape. We have the slim, toned, and the freaking R.O. Schwarzenegger of tieflings. Jesus. Alright, we'll go with that. And scaling. Um, go with a wide chest, wide shoulders, chest depth. Waist width, make him skinnier. Waist depth, make him skinnier. Arm length is fine. Bulk should be thinner. Um, leg length, let's make him tall. Leg bulk should be thinner. And tail size should be huge. Gotta have a huge tail. Just the way it goes, skinny guys. You know? Alright, so. Oh, 
guess that was it. So let us look at what the heck is this? Character origins. Um, I want to say the Moonshade Isles. Why not? Deity tour. I guess you can click on each one. God of Law. Nope. Out of, <laughs> out of battle. Uh, beauty. No. Uh, Lady Luck. Oh, there we go. I like that. And bam. There's our character. And most of my characters in any kind of role-playing setting, uh, I always have at least one character named Dragon, and that is what we are going to call our character, and this is where we're leaving off for this video. So next video, we'll get into uh, get into the game. See what happens. Oh,